Good morning. Today we are in Boynton Beach, Florida at Ben Gama Palm Beach Charter School. Today we get the privilege of living life through the eyes of a kindergartner. First up is drop off. We have heard the most exceptional things about your kindergarten program. Tell our viewers more about it. We love watching our kindergartners come to us. Some of them come to us barely even knowing a few letters and others come to us already reading. But we get to actually watch them grow and we get to be a part of that growth. And little by little, they're each growing at their own level. We take them from where they begin and we help them to get to grow at their own pace and little by little they're growing and they're learning and they're jumping through those hoops and making their gains and increasing their reading level and by the end of the year the ones that came to us barely knowing a few letters are reading on grade level and they're fully ready for first grade and those that came to us already reading are reading at even higher levels and they're reading above grade level and now they are there and they're strong readers and they're comprehending and some of them are already reading even on perhaps the second grade level and it's just fantastic. How would you help parents best prepare their children for elementary school? The main thing that we do for our incoming kindergartners is prior to school starting in the fall, we send out information in the summer. Children come into kindergarten on all different levels. Some children cannot recognize their names yet. Some children are reading books and that's fine, but we need to get them prepared so when they come in, we know where to start with them and where to get them to get going. Um, we send home information for them for their mathematics to help them with their number concepts and we also send home information for self-help self skills. Um, students, it's a big change for them coming into kindergarten and we want to make sure they can button their pants, they can unpack their backpacks um, and so that way they're successful when they come in their very first day. Every Friday we send a, an email updating parents on everything that took place that week in school as well as anything upcoming for the next week and then at the end of every month we send a kindergarten newsletter stating all of the things we've taught for that month as well as any special activities that have taken place and also events that are coming up in the next month. Tell us about some of the technology you're using in the classroom. We have quite a bit of technology. We use something called a smart board, which is like a gigantic projection screen. I can project on the screen and then we have special pens that the students can come up and write on the board for our math lessons. Um, I can do it for any lesson, really. Um, we have something that goes with the board called a slate, which is simply a rectangular board that we can use around the classroom so we don't always have to be up at the front of the room. Um, it's a fun way for them to interact without having to always be moving around. Um, we have something also to go with the board called Active Votes, and they're simply something that looks like an egg, and they have the letters of the alphabet A through F on them. And we put up multiple cho choice questions on the board, and they will vote on what they want. And it shows us who answered the question, what their answer was. They think they're playing a game, but it shows us who needs some more practice, who understands the skills that have been taught, and they're playing a game the entire time. Very cool. a typical day begin? So our morning routine starts where the students come in, they unpack their backpacks, they put their water bottles away, their agendas, their yellow communication folders, which has their homework, there's a separate bin for that. Then they come in and they take out their journals and they start writing for our morning message. Tell us about your family's experience at Bengamla. My family's experience at Bengamla has been wonderful. I've been a parent at the school since the very first day that Bengamla opened its doors. Um, from Mrs. Wiseman to the teachers to the staff, everybody here is wonderful. I tell all my friends and my family that sending your children to Bengamla is like sending your children to a private school without paying the private school tuition. We hear such great things about the enrichment program here at Ben Gamla. Please share a bit more. 
Absolutely. So here at Bengama, we offer enrichment programs to, from our kindergartners through our fifth graders in all different subject areas. Kids get to kind of really take charge of their own learning. They use choice boards. They do a lot of hands-on projects. They do research projects. They do technology projects. Um, they work together. They work with by themselves. There's a lot of different opportunities for kids to be enriched so they can truly shine as the true leaders and um, readers, writers, mathematicians, and scientists that they are. Tell us about your experience here at this school. Our family's experience has been wonderful at Bengama. I have one daughter who started in the traditional public schools and I felt like we didn't have the connection with the teachers or the principal that we get with Bengama. My younger daughter started from kindergarten and she's been doing excellent. She's now in second grade and I think that she's had some troubles and those troubles are countermanded by the fact that the teachers really take control of what's going on in the classroom. When a student falls behind, they really make sure that they get the extra work so that they can catch up and be on par with the other students. And I've seen that with my younger daughter. When she falls behind a little bit, I get notification from the teacher or from Principal Weitzman and I have the opportunity to boost those areas of education that she really needs. And I expect that she's going to do great when she gets to middle school and high school. What more could you ask for as a parent? To learn more about this unbelievable educational environment, check out their website or better yet, schedule a tour. Until next time, I'm Brie with United TV, uniting you with the world, one video at a time. Shalom.